Hi there, I'm Danny Sloan from Utah Education Network. This teacher tip is about digital citizenship. It may be difficult to find ways for you to fit digital citizenship into your specific curriculum, but it's an essential skill for our students. If we find ways to talk about digital citizenship during each class, we can take this sometimes complex and uncomfortable topic and make it part of their everyday routine. One of my tips for talking about digital citizenship each day is to model for your students when you are doing something to exhibit good digital citizenship and then talking them through your thinking out loud. Let's check out a few examples. The first way that you can model great digital citizenship for your students is when you have an email that's appropriate, share it with them, talk them through your thinking, and this is a great time to talk about email etiquette having a subject line, a salutation, important details, and then a nice sign off at the end. Use class examples. When your students are doing a great job collaborating in an online environment, or they're being very respectful in Canvas discussions, that's a great time to point it out to everyone. You can talk about how being positive and respectful online benefits all of us. And if you're going to share classroom examples, make sure to blur out the names first. You can also model great digital citizenship by showing your students the Safe UT app and talking through a time that you would have liked to use it as a student. Make sure they know the web address and that they can download the app anytime to talk to someone 24 seven. Another way to show great digital citizenship is to cite your sources. So next time you snake an image off the internet, make sure to put where you got it from. In Utah's online library, you can scroll to the bottom of almost any page and get a source citation, and then just pop that right into your slides. You can talk about screen time. And if you have any goals for yourself on screen time, why do you have those goals? And how do you stay focused when there are cell phone notifications going off all of the time? And last but not least, you can model great digital citizenship that when you don't know everything or you need some new ideas, you can take a class from UEN to help you out. Thank you for watching UEN Teacher Tips. We'll see you next week.